Hey guys, just wanted to come on here and give you a little bit of a uh, review, a uh, quick review if you will, on uh, the two flavors, the first two G Fuel flavors that I tried out of the starter kit because they give you, I think about um, eight flavors, I believe, ten or eight flavors. I think it's about, I think it's about eight, yeah, I think it's about eight flavors. Uh, the first two I tried was strawberry banana. And currently what I'm drinking right now, to kind of keep me going a little bit while I do stuff, is uh, bubble gum. And I can definitely tell you that the moment you open the packs of the, um, of the G Fuel, that basically you can smell exactly what, you know, uh, it is named after. You can smell, you know, the strawberry banana. You can smell the bubble gum. You can smell it in there. And when you mix it and everything, you know, give it about two and a half minutes, maybe three, depending on how much you really want to mix it. Um, basically, once you drink it, you can still smell the bubble gum or the strawberry banana um, in 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 the in the in your drink when you mix it with your water. Now, um, oh, now there are several more flavors. I think Max said it's about eight flavors. There's six more to try, I think. There's cotton candy, there's phase, there's the tea flavor that's based off as an evil, uh, and a few others, so we'll try those out soon. And uh, the kit, the starter kit, does come with a shaker, but they do sell shakers individually. I bought an extra shaker on the initial order uh, with the starter kit. <coughs> with the starter kit, uh, if you will, excuse me. As well as I bought... Um, another shaker late, a little afterwards. And uh, so far though, um, they're both pretty good. Uh, both flavors are pretty good, like I said. There is, um, there's about, pretty cool stuff. So, we got cotton candy left over. We have cotton candy. Let's do a try. We have phase, which is, we still gotta try. So, we still gotta try strawberry shortcake. They said that's another good one. And then we gotta try the Nemesis tea flavor. It's four. And then, I think. We got Babble Juice, and that's five. So they give you, set, actually, they give you about a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They give you seven flavors of the try. And uh, this is another one, Battle Juice, inspired by Phase. These, some of these flavors, like I said, are based off, uh, are based basically off of, um, or inspired by, other YouTubers and gaming, you know, products and all that. Um, for example, like I said, the Battle Juice. Um, this is a Phase. This is one. This one's based off Phase. It's just called Phase. That's all it is. And then the Battle Juice is based off Phase. And the Strawberry uh, Short uh, Shortcake is Apex, like Apex Legends. And then G Fuel is. Uh, Resident Evil uh, 3, or is it? No, it's Resident Evil Village, I think. And then, of course, you've got the Cotton Candy, which is just one of the original flavors. But they do have other ones as well. Uh, PewDiePie has a flavor. Dr. Disrespect has a flavor. And there's others in the works as, as well. Sonic's got a flavor, believe it or not. I got some of that. Yeah, they do have uh, different flavors, uh, not just, you know, of their creation, but of uh, creations, inspirations, uh, you know, by other, like I said, internet personas on, like here on YouTube, Twitch, and, and you know, gaming uh, franchises as well as I think even gaming consoles. And, and speaking of, you know, Twitch, you know, they have one as well. They have a, a I think, a grape one, a grape potion one. Uh, they have that. 
but yeah, it's a video overall, though. But yeah, overall, though, if you're not too sure about it at first, um, if you will, I would suggest trying out the starter kit. But so far, the two flavors that I've tried are actually pretty good. This one is the bubble gum. The other was the uh, strawberry banana. I did a video on that. You can check that out. Uh, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna try the other five flavors later and see what they're like. But overall, I'm liking what I'm seeing and, and tasting and enjoying. Uh, it is sugar free. In case you're wondering, it's indeed sugar free. But they've they've made it in such a way that you know, you know the uh, the flavor and uh, the um, the kind of a, the the flavor and and the electrolytes that they put in there for some of these, you know, make up for it. So, and it really does give you a pick you pick me up. It does really give you a pick me up, keeps you going a little bit. So, yeah, I would definitely uh, suggest G Fuel. Again, there's going to be flavors. As a matter of fact, uh, once again at the end of this video, I'll provide a video link to the live stream Joe did with Alex and other Joe last year, last July. And you know, pretty much see from their experience that there's flavors that get a top five rating from them, but there's also flavors that are like, you know, it's like, are you kidding? I mean, if you're into coffee, they do have a French vanilla coffee mix that's more vanilla than anything. And I think they said the same for the cotton candy, but again, it's all dependent on taste. So, um, yeah, it's, you know, it's up to you what you want to do. But I do suggest trying it out if you want. Um, I do recommend, well, not suggest, but I recommend you try it out if you want. Uh, the starting kit is about $17, I think, so try it out. Uh, and I think you'll enjoy it. I think there'll be flavors in there that you'll enjoy, you might tolerate, and you may not. So, because what the starter kit does is it kind of gets you, you know, um, familiar with the product. So that when you decide, okay, I want to get a tub of it, or even get those aluminum cans, because they do have cans, you'll choose the flavors you want for um, you know for you to, to have in your home to, to try to you know take to like take to work or something like that or whatever the case may be but overall I really like it and again I highly recommend it and a big shout out to the Angry Joe show uh, for recommending this and allowing them to sponsor their show it's a it's a great product and you know, they're not paying me to say this, G Fuel that is, they're not sponsoring me or paying me to say this, I'm saying that in fact, but these first two flavors are good, and I might enjoy most of them, maybe there might be, be a few exceptions, but so far I like what I'm tasting and drinking, and again, it's sugar free, but it does give you a pick you up, you know, because of the ad other added ingredients they have in there, along with the flavors they use uh, to, go, to go with it. So, yeah, I definitely suggest trying out recommend or suggest trying out G Fuel uh, see how you like it uh, again I would suggest the starter kit it, it's great it gives you basically a seven pack sample of flavors to, to put in the shaker that they that comes with it or any additional shaker you may want to use utilize with it or if you want to go the route that I and Angry Joe and his crew did and that's basically take the bottle of waters you have and just add the flavors in there I would try that too so, yeah, that's, but yeah, that's all I'm going to say, guys. Uh, let me know what your thoughts are down below. Comment if you like. Again, big shout out to Angry Joe and Angry Joe Show for uh, uh, suggesting this and allowing G Fuel to sponsor them. And G Fuel, shout out to you guys. Uh, so far, I'm liking what I'm tasting. I mean, I know there's going to be hits and misses for you guys. Uh, but hey, maybe, maybe you'll get a flavor down there that nobody will complain about whatsoever. You know, like, I mean, you do have flavors, but... I'm saying you might have a flavor that basically, like, you know, gets a 10-star rating instead of a 5-star, if you know what I mean. Uh, but let me know what you guys, but again, big shout-out to G-Fuel, and thank you guys for making this stuff. It really helps out, especially without the sugar. Uh, but let me know what you guys' thoughts are down, down below. Comment if you like. Let me know what your thoughts on the live chat are, and I am out.